Hey, it's Brian Goulet of Goulet Pen Company and Ink Nouveau. I want to show off the new gunmetal black matte vanishing point. It's a new pen that just came out. I just got it in like a couple hours ago, so I want to show it off. If you like the black matte vanishing point, this one looks pretty sweet too, I gotta admit. I saw pictures of it beforehand and I thought it looked cool, but seeing it in person now looks even better. So I wanna go ahead and show it off. Oh, hey Gunmetal. Hey Black Matt, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing pretty good. Say, you wanna hang out sometime? Yeah, I'll do that. Oh yeah. And thus, the gun metal with black matte hardware is born. It's a sweet looking pen. I know I'm a retailer and I sell these and I'm totally biased, but dag on it, that looks awesome. Okay, so basically, from what I can tell, Pilot has taken the black matte vanishing point and put a gunmetal finish on the body and mated the two together to make the gunmetal with black matte accent. I think that's what it's called. I call it the gun matte, <laughs> just to make it easier. But anyway, that's the pen. It's the same vanishing point that you know and love. Um, the one thing about it is that it originally was kind of rumored to come with this box, which is the black matte vanishing point box. So it's got this cool little, um, you know, thing going on here where uh, the pen comes in this kind of two layered plastic shadow box. And then it kind of like floats in there like that. It's pretty cool, kind of big, not super practical, uh, but this pen does not come with that. This pen comes in this box, which is your standard Pilot Vanishing Point box. Uh, comes with, you know, your typical Pilot goodies. Uh, comes with a Pilot Namiki cartridge, uh, metal cartridge cap that you put over the cartridge if you're gonna use it uh, in, the, in the Vanishing Point here. Um, and uh, your instructions, use guide, and all that stuff. So, but anyway, this is the pen uh, I like it. I like it a lot. There's um, several different grays to the black matte, or sorry, several different grays in the Vanishing Point line. Uh, there are, uh, is the, um, basically three different ones, and the, the gunmetal is the darkest of the three grays. Um, and I think it complements the back black quite well. If you're not familiar with the Vanishing Point, uh, it is a click retractable fountain pen. It comes with a rhodium plated 18 karat gold nib. Uh, now, of course, some retailers may choose to give the option to buy just the body or to buy the pen with a gold nib, if, or a gold colored nib, if you prefer that instead of the rhodium colored. Uh, in the rhodium colored, there's an option of extra fine, fine, medium, or broad. In the yellow gold nib, there is fine, medium, and broad, just to let you know what your options are there. But, uh, you know, it's a, uh, I've covered the vanishing point in, in several other videos, uh, but basically there's a nib unit here in the middle that just pulls out. Nice skinny nib here. The filler hole is right here. So when you fill it, you need to immerse the nib all the way up to this point. It's got a removable, uh, just friction fit Pilot Con 50 converter. Um, and it's a newer pen, so it's coming with the little uh, metal agitator on the inside and uh, that's that's basically about it so it's a, it's a nice looking pen you know there's really not too much else going on it's just a new finish on the pen uh, but I, I gotta say I like it there you go if you have any questions or want to comment on it love to hear what your thoughts are go ahead and comment below uh, thanks for watching spending time with me and right on